Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello, my name is Andi Anissa Shawamalia from X3. Here I will present a report tech assignment with the theme of tsunamis. The term of tsunami comes from the Japanese which mean herbal su and wave nami. A tsunami is a series of waves generated when water in a lake or the sea is rapidly displaced on a massive scale. A tsunami can be generated when the sea floor absolutely deform and vertical displaces the overlying water. Such large vertical movement of the earth crust can occur at plate boundaries. Subduction of earthquakes are particularly effective in generating tsunami. An accord where denser oceanic plates slip under continental plates. Tsunami always bring great damage. Most of the damage is caused by the half mass of water behind the initial wave form. As the height of the sea keeps rising fast and float powerful into the coastal area. That's all from my explanation about the tsunamis. Thank you. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Akhil Rafi Hendarto. I'm from class at 10-3. I, my number absent is 2. Today I will presentation about the fallen star. On the rim of the solar system that's so cold, it resides also the chang chang of ice and hardness around the sun. The distance is estimated to range between 50,000 until 100,000 times the distance of the sun and the earth. When it starts close to the sun, then the ice will begin to experience a warming. Ice melts and evaporates quickly. Water vapor that then forms a sheet and a tail of slabs of ice. The chunk of ice that vaporizes the sun this is object we know as comets but comets contain water not only purely but also the metal minerals as there is on the rocks a few comets have orbits that intersect with the with the earth's orbit so there are times when the earth crosses the orbit of comet some will and when that happens then the earth will have breath the hardest of meteoroids that come from comets then both collide when the meteoroids meteoroids that pass through the atmosphere very quickly then the meteoroids meteoroids that will blow with air or particles this friction will cause the heat quickly burn meteoroids the phenomenon of burning meteoroids in the atmosphere we know as meteor I think that's all from me. Thank you. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hi guys, my name is Alicia Karijana Raswari from X3. Here I will present a report text entitled Bullying. Definition of Bullying Bullying is any form of detention or violence which is carried out intentionally by a person or group that is more powerful. The purpose of this bullying is to hurt other people and it's done continuously. Bullying is grouped into six categories including direct verbal contact, direct physical contact, direct nonverbal behavior, indirect nonverbal behavior, and cyberbullying. Impact of bullying first triggers depression, stress, mental health disorder, stress triggers anger. Second, has an impact on lowering the level intelligence and analytical ability of children. Causes of bullying: physical appearance, class difference, seniority tradition, and family. How to overcome bullying? Early detection of bullying action, providing socialization regarding bullying, providing support to victim, making firm rules about bullying, and helping the perpetrator stop his bad behavior. I think it's done to my video, so bye!
everyone, my name is Anggi Jadi Satya Nasir from X3, absent 4. Now, I will explain the meaning of rainbow. Bye! What is rainbow? Rainbow is a natural phenomenon that is so impressive. This phenomenon often appears after rain. How did the rainbow happen? Let's explain. Rainbow is an earth spectrum which is so large and occurs because the drops are refracted by sunlight. When the sun is shining and the light passing through water droplets, then you will see a reflection that causes a white variety of colors. Light is reflected like light pressing through a glass prism. So that's the explanation. Sorry if there is a lack of explanation. See you, bye bye. Hello everyone, my name is Arga Setiadi. I will present the nebula stars. A nebula is an interstellar cloud of dust, gas, and plasma. Originally, nebula was the general name given to all expensive astronomical objects, including galaxies beyond the Milky Way. Nebula are made of many things. Most nebula from as emission nebula. Nebula like this from when a newly formed star ionizes the gas around it, creating an emission nebula. There are also nebula formed from supernova and nova explosion. The nebula that formed from the supernova is called the supernova remain. And the nebula formed from the result of the nova is called the remain of a nova. Nebula are often also formed from stars like the suns as they are on their way to the, the white dwarf stage. This nebula is known as a planetary nebula. This nebula is formed when a star like the sun runs out of fuel. This causes the star to continue to grow until it finally blow its stellar wind on a large scale, causing it to lose its mass. The stellar wind then from a planetary nebula and the star becomes a white dwarf. That's all from my explain to nebula star. Thank you. Hi everyone, I am Olesiela from Chris X3. I will explain the report text about accession. From Jupiter is a different negative before the true world accession. Some cause of formation shows at the failure of adults to oppose religious and Pancasila religious norms. Your in health attitude can also ice emotion, signage, stress, depression, anxiety, and hallucination. These hormonal families can always cause children to their own happiness compared to at home and actually to fall into promiscuity. Type of promiscuity Sex free Brawl Darts and cigarettes clubbing. In the impact, drug addiction is after withdrawal and error until finally addiction. Having sex healthy dis discouraged because of free sex. That's all my report text and thank you. Bye. Hello guys, my name is Kalista Sar Claudia Hakim. So today I'm gonna telling a story about mermaid. Bruh. So let's get started. Dari tadi aku ngomong gak kerekam guys. Mermaid, a water creature that has a body like a woman from the waist to head, while the rest of her body from the waist down resemble a fish.
Mermaid are mythology creator, half human, half animal creator. Where do mermaids come from? In Greek mythology, mermaids are said to have always seduced surly sailors. Anyone who is tempted will meet them. Mermaids are also associated with siren in Greek mythology. As are the sirens, an order of marine mammals consisting of mermaids and sea oxen. Some of the testimony of encounter with mermaids by ancient sailors are most likely a, mis a mistake in observation the shape of the marine mammals. Christopher Columbus thought the half that he had seen mermaids while exploring the Caribbean Sea. A report of sighting also exists in the 20 and 21 countries in Canada, Israel, and Zimbabwe. In 2012, the UC National Ocean Service thought that no advance of mermaids that have ever found. So sad. Mermaids have also become a popular subject in art and literature in modern time. So that's it for me. Thank you for watching and apologize if there are any mistakes. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. A few moments later. A few inches later. Two hours later. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Good morning. My name is the Fina Telephone Mystica, number absent nine. Now I will tell you about report text panda. Panda is a bear native to South Central China. It is easily recognized by the large distinctive black panthers around its eyes, over the ears, and across its round body. So it belongs to the order Carnivora. Panda's diet is over 99% bamboo. Panda has a body shape typical of bears. It has black fur on its ears, eyes patches, muzzle, legs, arms, and shoulders. The rest of the animal is called its white. Also, scientists do not know why the unsoil bear are black and white. Speculations guess that the bold coloring to provide effective camouflage in the desert set, typically snowy and rocky habitat. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Introduce my name is Dedi Febrianto Sunario from class 10C, absent number 10. On this occasion, I will do a sample report next about Holocline. Do you know what causes the two waters in the picture not to merge? Well, in the field of oceanography, this phenomenon is called a Holocline. This phenomenon has nothing to do with river pollution. The halokan phenomenon itself can occur due to differences in density, salinity, or salt content vertically, and density that are significant enough between water to cause the two waters to separate as if there is a barrier wall between them. The barrier itself can be seen because the meeting between the two waters is followed by a fairly weak wave current which results in the absence of strong mixing so that the layer or barrier can be seen clearly. Haloclines can occur in zones where there is a drastic drop in salinity that affects the density of the water. This view shows the sea divided by two different colors. This phenomenon is most likely to occur in zones where two seas of the different salt content meet as happens in the Strait of Gibraltar where seawater from the Atlantic Ocean meets the Mediterranean Sea. Even in Indonesia, the Halakhan event itself has occurred, precisely in this Madura Strait. That's all the text of the report from me about natural phenomena. Thank you.
Hopefully, this brief information can improve the insight of all of us. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Erika Saskia Devi from X3. Here I'm gonna present a report text about how rainbow is formed. A rainbow is an optical phenomenon form when visible light is captured by airborne water droplets such as rain, mist, spray, or dew. And the sun is shining from behind you at low altitude angel. This means that you usually see rainbow in western sky during the morning and in the eastern sky during the early evening. We see sunlight as white light, but it is made from a spectrum of different colors, each having a different wavelength. As water is more dense than air, light passing from the air into water droplets slow down and change duration in a process called refraction. The different wavelengths slow by different amounts with the shorter blue and violet wavelengths refraction more and going through an increased change of direction than the longer red wavelengths of light. This puts the white light into its component colors by dispersion. As the light hits the back of the droplet, if the angle of incidence is large enough, it will be internally reflected back out of the droplet. As the light exists, the droplet is speed up and it's refracted again, further dispersing the colors. Due to the reflection from the back of the droplets, the blue light emerges at a smaller angle of 40 degrees to the incident white light, whilst the red light emerges at a larger angle of 42 degrees. This is why we see blue on the inside of Primo Rainbow Arc and the red on the outside. If you are standing in the right place, you will see the dispersed sunlight reflected back towards you as a colorful curved rainbow. Beyond the seven well-known colors, a rainbow is actually made up of a continuous spectrum of colors, including those that human eye cannot see. That's all my explanation about rainbow. Thank you for watching. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Fairus Daria Etiza. I am from class X3. I am here to explain about meteor shower. A meteor shower is an astronomical phenomenon that occurs when a number of meteors are seen shining in the night sky. These meteors occur because of the fragment of space object called meteoroids, which enter the Earth's atmosphere at high speed. Meteors are generally only the size of a grain of sand, and almost all of them dis disintegrate before reaching the Earth's surface. The debris that reaches the Earth's surface is called a meteorite. Meteor shower generally occurs the Earth crosses near the ob orbit of a comet and passes through its debris. According to NASA, fast meteors can leave behind long strings of glow, which last for a few seconds the, to several minutes. In general, about 13 eta aquariate meteors can be seen per hour during the peak of the meteor shower happen. May 2023 meteor showers phenomenon, the event will occur on May 6, 2023. Okay, thank you for watching the video that I made. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Gelsi Tanisa, and in this video, I'm going to talk a little and discuss about the controversial project in the early 2023 Willow Project. So let's check it out. So Willow Project is an oil drilling venture proposed by Conoco Phillips in the North Slope of Alaska in the National Petroleum Reserve, which belongs to the United States federal government. Joe Biden has given permission to carry out this project on March 13, 2023. So what is the goal of this project actually? This project was made with the aim to increase the economy of people in the Alaska with 600 barrels of oil which greatly benefits the region's economy. However, why is this project criticized by many people? Because if this project goes ahead, there will be 287 million tons of carbon dioxide released over the next 30 years, which will cause a global warming that really can be a great danger for us. About the Willow Project in this video, 
I'm sorry for the wrong information or the mistakes that I made in this video. And thank you. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello everyone. Let me introduce myself first. So, my name is Haikal Khairul Adam and today I will tell you what is the thunder. Yes. What is thunder? Thunder is created when lightning passes through the air. The lightning discharge hits the air rapidly and causes it to expand. The temperature of the air in the lightning channel may reach as high as 50,000 degrees Fahrenheit. Wow! Five times hotter than the surface of the sun. Oh my god! And two, why is the thunder so loud? It's because the amount of electrical energy that flows from the cloud to the ground is so enormous. Hello guys, my name is Imari Tatianing Sukma. You can call me Imai. I'm go today I'm gonna telling story about Nyirorakido. Nyirorakido is an ideal expression of portraying a mighty woman. Nyirorakido is the queen of the south coast. Nyirorakido is also a savior of protects the existence of the Mataram kingdom. Many versions describe the figure of Nyirorakidul. It is a real thing that is hidden or supernatural thing that is made as if it were real. Nyirorakidul is more than a concho winking alias a sleeping companion as, as is the action description. There's it for me. Thank you for watching. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Let me introduce myself. My name is Kevin Francisco Smanik. I'm from Tennessee. I will uh, make video a uh, reportek about laptop. Let's enjoy the video. Laptop is a portable computer that we can carry everywhere every day and can be put in a school bag. Well, the people call it a laptop. Laptop is also known as notebook or power book. Generally, the weight of a laptop is in, in the range of 1 to 6 kilograms depending on the size, material and up specification of the laptop itself. Laptops are designed in a mobile manner with small size and weak weight. Laptops also have several components such as monitors, keyboards, speakers, and others. Laptop screens are usually 10 to 17 inches in size. Batteries on laptops can be charged using a laptop charger adapter to charge the battery. Usually a battery on laptop if full charger can be used for 3 hours depending on the usage and power management of the laptop itself. Laptops are also suitable for use by various groups like housewife, student, and office workers because laptop can help users do things like make reports and PPT. I'm introducing myself. My name is Krista Suka Satriawan from class XC. Uh, I'm here to tell how. Whales communicate. Whales are very social creatures that travel in group called pods. They use a variety of noise to communicate and socialize with each other. The three main types of sound made by whales are clicks, whistle, and pulse calls. Clicks are believed to be for navigation and identifying physical surroundings. When the sound wave bounces off on object, they return to the well, allowing the well to identify the shape of the object. Clicks can even help to different between friendly critters and predators. Clicks have also been observed during social interaction, suggesting they may also have a communication function. Whistle and pulse calls are used during the social activities. 
pulse call are more frequent and sounds like a squeaks, screams, and squawks to the human ear. Differing vocal dialects have been found to exist between different pods within the same whale population. This is most likely so that whales can different 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 between whales within their pots and strangers whales also use their tails and fins to make loud slapping noise on the surface the sounds can be heard for hundreds of meters below the surface and may be a warning sign of aggression or a tool scare schools of fish together make them an easier meal in the Stellwagen Bank National Marine Sanctuary and UAA scientists attack sensor to whales in order to track their movement patterns. They hope to learn about the whales' behavior and communication as well. To observe how human interaction affects their behavior. Thank you. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello guys, my name is Larasati Alezedi from 103 Today, I will present my assignment about kangaroo A kangaroo is an animal found only in Australia although it has a smaller relative called a wallaby which live on the Australian island of Tasmania and also in New Guinea Kangaroos eat grass and plants. They have short front legs, but very long and very strong back legs and a tail. These are used for sitting up and for jumping. Kangaroos have been known to make forward jumps of over 8 meters, and leap across fences more than 3 meters high. They can also run at speeds of over 45 kilometers per hour. The largest kangaroos are the great grey kangaroo and the red kangaroo. Adults grow to a length of 1.60 meters and weigh over 90 kilos. Kangaroos are marsupials. This means that the female kangaroo has an external pouch on the front of her body. A baby kangaroo is very tiny when it is born and it crawls at once into this pouch where it spends its first 5 months of life. That's all from my presentation about kangaroo. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh My name is Muza Kurnia Dharma From grad then third absent 19 So I will present my work Floods are the most frequent natural disasters in Indonesia The definition of flooding is a situation where an area is inundated by water in larger quantities Floods can be predicted by paying attention to rainfall and water flow, but sometimes floods can come suddenly due to storm winds or a breach in an embankment, which is commonly called a flat flood. Cause of flooding include high rainfall light surface is slower than sea level apart from rain flooding can also occur during the moon rain season which usually occurs in coastal areas flood the flood that occur that are that are not really so many presentation for me thank you friend Assalamualaikum wabarakatuh. My name is Muhammad Ketfana Tarila and I'm from class 103. My absent is 22. So, uh, I want to tell you to make Sigland Galaxy like. 
uh, one how to use how to use one indoor us projecting in the sky direction two how to use the light projector as shown below three connect bluetooth btk 10 of the smartphone to play music four use correct method of the remote control to make sure the remote control is pointing at the infrared sensor uh, so this is uh, how to play this sing let galaxy light uh, and uh, i want to tell you uh, sing let galaxy light for home party night light relaxation i'm just like study dinner game room and uh, i'm for to sleep so uh, this is thank you assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello everyone, my name is Muhammad Gaddafi from grade 10 tier. Here I am making a report text about Borobudur Temple. Borobudur is Hindu Buddhist temple. It was built in the 9th country under Selandra dynasty of Asian Mataram Kingdom. Borobudur is located in Magelang, Central Java, Indonesia. Borobudur is well known all over the world. Its construction is influenced by the Gupta architecture of India. The temple is constructed on a hill, 46 meter thick and consists of eight steps like stone terrace. The first five terraces are secure and surrounded by walls underneath with Buddhist sculptures and reveals. The upper three are circular. Each of them is circled by bell shaped stupa. The entire temple is crowned by a large stupa at the center of the top circle. The way to the summit extends through some 4.8 km of passages and stairways. The design of Borobudur, which symbolizes the structure of universe, is similar to anchor Cambodia. Borobudur Temple, which is dedicated as an Indonesian Monument in 1983 is a flower treasure for Indonesian people. That's all from the text of me report. If there is an error, sorry. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Muhammad Iskandirian, and tonight I will read text about Polo. Uh, yeah, Polo. <laughs> Originally discovered in the 19th century, the Polo shirt itself began to to be produced to be produced in 1896 by a clothing company called Brooks Brother. After entering the early 20th century, Polos, eh, Polo, Polo shirt began a, began to the develop. As the result. There was an safety among the tennis player because the previous polo shirt was considered uncomfortable. Prior to 1913, polo players wore, wore thick long sleeve shirt made, uh, made of cotton or sport cloth. This shirt was the first. This dessert was the first to have a button-down collar which polo player invented in the late 19th century to keep the color afloat. This was realized by John Brooks, the first president of, Brook, of Brooks Brothers. Dur during a polo match in, the, in England and began producing dessert in year 1896, Brooks Brothers still manufactures button color style polo shirt today. 
but like tennis attire at first it also presents some di- discomfort on the court when polo players become aware of Lacoste's invention they immediately adopt adopted it for use in the sport of polo thank you i think that's all of my retex polo thank you for the opportunity bye bye Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh My name is Nadia Citra Ayu I will present the chronology of the 182 SDS Riwijaya Air KNKT revealed the result of the investigation into the cause of the Sriwijaya Air SD 182 accident which fell on January 9, 2021 Faktor causing the Sriwijaya Air SJ-182 accident were mechanical factors such as throat asymmetry. Throat asymmetry is a condition where the position of the throat lever is not the same between the right and left in Sriwijaya Air SJ-182 which both Throttle will in the forward position to produce large, large engine power. Because the plane is climbing to the desired altitude, the air traffic controls stop at 11,000 feet because another plane is about to course. Hi, I'm Nelsari from X3. Here I will present a report text assignment with the theme Tornado. Tornado are the rotating columns of air that form inside storms that connect with the ground via a funnel of clouds. When that happens, they tear across the earth, pushing a hot to life and property. Tornado begin with a thunderstorm, but not just any thunderstorm. These are especially powerful turning thunderstorm called supercell. Reaching up to over 15,000 feet, they bring high force of wind. Jet high storms sometimes flooding and great forces of lightning too. These are the kind of storm the best tornadoes, but only if there are also very specific conditions in place. Clues that we can measure and look out for when we're trying to force a storm. Rising air is the first ingredient needed for a tornado to develop. Any storm is far away when condensation occurs. The byproducts of the clouds. Condensation releases heat, and heat becomes the energy that drives hook apart drafts of air. The more condensation and the bigger the storm clouds grow, the more powerful the of dust become. In supercell, this rising air mass is particularly strong. As the air climbs, it can change direction and start to move more quickly. Finally, at the storm base, if there is a lot of moisture, a huge cloud base develops, giving the tornado sometimes to fit of letter if it gets that far. When all these things are in place, a vortex can develop and close by the storm and forming a wet tall tube of spinning at the tanky spot of our sh- We call this mesocyclone. Outside, cool, dry, sinking air starts to wrap around the back of this mesocyclone. Forming what's known as a real flying down draft, unusual scenario creates a start temperature difference. The air inside the mesocyclone and the air outside, building up a level of instability that allows a tornado to drive. The mesocyclone lower part becomes tighter, increasing the speed of the wind. If, and that's a big if, this funnel of air moves down into that large moist cloud base at the bottom of the parent storm, check it in and turns it into a rotating wall of cloud, forming a link between the storm that created it and the earth, making that tube of spinning cloud touches the ground. It becomes a tornado. Okay, that's all for my explanation. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Nayla Zaratunisam. So now I will show you about report text of the term in rain. The first time we will need the sun. When the sun shines water on the surface of the earth, the heat of the sun that warms the air in turns in into an invisible gas called water vapor. This process of water becoming gas is called evaporation. 
Kel it hitting gas lighter than liquid water vapor rises to the sky and the farther you move up and away from the surface of the earth and the temperature increases rises so that in the sky the water vapor gets colder and changes back into small water droplets. This change is called condensation and is the offset of disappearing clouds are made up of tiny water droplets so that when condensation occurs in the sky clouds form and grow. Let's take a closer look. When water droplets collide with each other, they shake together and grow until it gets too heavy and falls as rain. They even grew until it was too heavy and fell as rain. They even meet each other on their way. That's all from my explanation about rain. So thank you. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Novian Timutiara Salsabila. In this video, I will present our report text about the aurora borealis. So, let's the video. An aurora is a natural light display in the sky. This beautiful phenomenon occurs in the universe on a planet as a result of the interaction between the magnetic field of the planet owned by charged particles emitted by the sun or the solar wind. There are various colors of aurora, usually green, red, blue, and violet. Aurora also calls as dance of the spirit or polar lights. On the earth, aurora occurs in Iran, the north, and south pole because of the influ influence of magnetic fields. Aurora that happen in the in northern are called the aurora borealis. This name comes from the Roman goddess of the Aurora and the great name for North Wind Boreas. You can see the Aurora Borealis in Iceland, Finland, Canada, Norway, and Alaska that occurs between September and October and March and April. Maybe that's all from this video. Thank you for watching. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Putra Banu Haji. My class is X3 and my absent is 28. Today I want to explain to you all about supernova. Supernova is a very energetic explosion of a large and massive star that it, that is at a certain point in this life cycle. Supernova occur when there is change in the core or center of a massive star nuclear change that can occur in two different ways with both producing supernova based on scientific studies report by life science the supernova will be visible again in the new future now and the recime supernova the fan flash of a 10 billion year size explosion will appear in the sky around to 2037. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello everyone, my name is Putri Afia Agustin from X3. Here, I will present a report text assessment about volcanic eruption. Volcanic eruption are a process of the magma exceeding from within the magma chamber located inside the volcano. This happens because there is magma activity as well as tectonic plate movement. Volcanic eruption are natural disaster because they carry magma, hot and cold lava, densos, and others. As a result, the land around the volcano will be damaged, disrupting the farming activities of the surrounding residents. Residents will also lose livestock, homes, and others followables. Nevertheless, volcanic eruption will bring benefits in the long term because the volcanic ash that comes out will make the surrounding agriculture 
land fertile. Materials from volcanic eruption such as sand and stone can be used for new housing, development, and others. In addition, new jobs such as sand mining will be opened so that people who lose their property can continue to work to obtain their daily needs. That's all from my explanation about volcanic eruption. Thank you. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Good morning, hi everyone. Introduce, my name is Raden Solhudin Riza, class X3, option 30. I will explain about explain about the solar eclipse. A total solar eclipse which is when the moon completely covers the sun, so that the corona which envelops the sun in is actually much dimmer than the sun become visible at the eclipse cause of a total solar eclipse the movement of the earth sun and moon is the main factor that influence the occurrence of the total solar eclipse phenomenon when GMT occurs, the moon is between the sun and the earth till it gave the moon. What are the consequences of a total solar eclipse? During a total solar eclipse, there is a sudden change in temperature and air pressure. This affects the moisture and life of the embryo so that the hatching rate will increase thank you all for listening to everyone the explain wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh my name is rasya kersa mandala my class is x3 and my absent is 32 today i wanna explain to you all about banjir floods are natural disaster events that occur when excessive water flows submerge the land the european union's flood directive defines a flood as the temporary covering by water of land that is not normally covered by water in the sense of flowing water these words can also mean the inflow of the tide floods are caused by the volume of water in a body of, of water such river or lake overflows or overflows from a dam, a dam so that water comes out of the river. Hi, my name is Raya Shakira Wisati and here I am presenting a report text with the title The Last Day of Dinosaur. Dinosaur consists of various groups of animals from different morphology, taxonomy, and ecology. It's believed that they were first appear in the Triassic period about 230 million years ago. They ruled the earth for 160 million years. But one day, the world were destroyed. One of the most well-known theories for the death of dinosaurs is the Alvarez hypothesis. In 1980, these two scientists proposed the notion that a meteor the size of a mountain slammed into Earth 66 million years ago. Touching a 180km crater and unleashing firestorms, eruption, and mega tsunamis across the globe. The debris block out the sun for years dinosaurs and the other 75 percent of life that went down with them didn't stand a change it's so sad to think about how dinosaurs went extinct and i think that's all from me bye bye thank you Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello everyone, my name is Salma Amalia Nabila I'm from Tansi So in this opportunity, I would like to present my report text about robot Robot is a machine especially when programmable by a computer capable of carrying out a complex series of actions automatically 
Robots can be guided by an external control device or the control may be embedded within. Robots may be constructed on the lines of human form, but most robots are machines designed to perform a task with no regard to how they look. Nowadays, the kinds and the specification of robots are various. They are robots for war, robot to work, robot to secure, and so on. Robot can be used to overcome the limit of human being in doing something and usually it refers to something dangerous. For example, to understand the whole solar system outside the Earth, robot can be created and programmed for a specific duty to get any information such as collected data about any materials in Mars. Robot can do this easily and better than human because robot only needs one energy sources such as atomic battery while humans still need water, food, and oxygen to be survived on the alien lands. Thus, robot is perhaps the most important modern technology creature after machine and computer to help human get better life. Even though there are still some debates about the existence of some robot in which it is considered as something bad such as soldier robot, perhaps this case is easy to be understood by watching Robocop movie in which robot has no heart, morale, desire, and perspective to understand human as the way human does. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoy it and goodbye. See you next time. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hi guys, my name is Shafara Rasulullah from class 10.3, absent 25. Today, I want to presentation my report text about forest fires. Forest fires are large, uncontrolled fires that occur in wooded areas. They are often started by lightning strike, human activities such as arson, or even an accidental spark from a campfire. Forest fires can rapidly spread due to the evidence of flammable materials present in forests. They can grow to hundreds or even thousands of acres in size with devastating effects. Forest fires are extremely dangerous because they can cause injury and death to people who become trapped in the flames and smoke. They also destroy homes and infrastructure while releasing harmful greenhouse gas into the atmosphere. Additionally, forests provide habitat for many species of animals and plants so the loss of these habitats can be catastrophic. While some forest fires are caused naturally, humans play a large role in their spirit and intensification due to activities such as logging, urban sprawl, and climate change. The effects of forest fires can be minimized through careful planning, proper management of fire-prone areas, early detection, and prevention measures. It is important to take action to protect our forests from these destructive fires. Thank you for listening. If there is a world war, please forgive. Thank you all. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello, I'm Tribuna Singhi from X3. Here I will present a report text assignment with the theme of lunar eclipse. The lunar eclipse is an event of the sun, the earth, and the moon fly on one line so that the shadow of the earth covers a part or whole moon. The lunar eclipse that occur on this earth distinguish to several types. They are total lunar eclipse, partial lunar eclipse, and lunar eclipse penumbra. The process of the lunar eclipse begins when the earth is between the sun and the moon on the same line. The result is the sunlight cannot reach the moon because it is blocked up by the earth. A total lunar eclipse is when the moon is right in the umbra. On a partial lunar eclipse, the earth is sun entirely blocking the moon from the sun, while the other half of the surface of the moon is in the penumbra area. So there is still some sunlight that reaches the surface of the moon. On the lunar eclipse penumbra, a part of the moon are in the penumbra, so the moon can still be seen with a gloomy color.
Okay, that's all for my explanation about the lunar eclipse. Thank you. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Inda Sabrina, class 10C. Number absent 37. Lastly, the gecrival process they happen because or then move on aromas are. Soil sustainable clump of soil. Why they form? That main skin of ten. Montile or lil lens leader or shall I have any in the mutions or muslin lens in heaven because of a ten must grown. Flight way costs ten as or the so he crying during. Theorine Theon also calling. Long dry tune of red well water. A mount will make for our shall copy. The wall because on the ground rain fall. Then rain in the Thanks water are rock. Then both of us all and use clutter move like a last little If slice you make a fall, house and first bed If they is different from my soul, friendless, no have fun, start a car, I bought art Thank you